Hey guys, it's me, Addison. Um, so, I have an update on my three month challenge. I know, I can't wait to already have an update, but I just want you to know temptation is real. <laughs> um, this past weekend, we went to the Navy Exchange for a few things we needed. Um, and I've been looking at sling backpacks for quite some time, probably like a year now. I've been talking about it, like, oh, you know, I think I'd like to have one, but I don't know if I'd actually use it. And I like it, but you can only keep it on one shoulder. You can't switch it. And I just don't know. I kept going back and forth. But I have a friend who's carried the same sling backpack for like two years. And she rarely changes out of it. And we had a whole conversation this past weekend about how much she loves it. And I was like, okay, yeah, that could work. Um, so as we went to the Navy Exchange and they had one that was um, Vera Bradley. It was beautiful. Um, like a water-resistant material. It was like a really pretty emerald green color with floral and polka dots. I mean, it was, it was beautiful. Um, but the more I thought about it, it's just, it would not go with hardly anything in my out, in my wardrobe. Like it just did not match my style. And, um, you know, like you, you see those things, or at least I do. <laughs> I see things in the store, I'm like, oh, that's beautiful, and that would go with this and this, and like a really pretty twirly dress and yellow rain boots, and you know, a very feminine look, or like a Jessica Day look, and um, and then you get home, and you don't have any of that stuff in your wardrobe, and you're like, oh, I guess this wasn't me that I was picturing, it was somebody else, like it's like a, it's called a fantasy self thing, I guess, um, so... I recognize that that's what that purchase would have been. It would have been for um, somebody else. Like, that I, I love the style, but it just doesn't match me. Like, when I put it on, it just doesn't match me. It feels weird. Um, there was a time in my life where I definitely tried to dress a lot. Like, I don't know. With a lot of, lot of dresses. And it just, I don't know. <laughs> I digress. Um, so I did not get that one. However, they did have some Kavu ones. They had some beautiful patterns. Um, but they had a solid colored one, copper rust color. Um, really, really pretty. And my husband's like, well, you need to get it. You've been talking about one for forever. That's your style. Like, he knows my style better than me. Sometimes he's like, that's your style. You need to get it. I was like, I don't know. Um, it's going to kind of put a damper on my three month challenge if I get it. He's like, we don't have to carry it right away. Um, so he bought it for me. When we get home and I'm looking at it and I keep trying it on, I'm like, oh, okay, this is not helping me. Uh, and so we put it in our safe <laughs> so that um, I would not be tempted to um, look at it or want to put it on because that's how low my self-control is that is so sad <laughs> but uh so if you're feeling bad about your self-control just remember me and that should make you feel better so it's in the safe right now um so i am still carrying this one um and i've actually kind of fallen more in love with it as it's gone on um because i know where everything's at now like i'm not like oh where did i put that like i know i've specific pocket for my keys for mask for hand sanitizer like I know where everything's at which the hand sanitizer I did change up because I did put the key not key fob but the fob I don't know what this is a hand sanitizer pouch um on it but yeah I've really enjoyed it so far um I did change wallets because the other one was really really small and that was gonna work for the purse that didn't work um but it was just getting lost in here kind of it just didn't um keep its organization the way that i prefer my purses to but you can see now that um there is the wallet that i'm carrying right now i did buy these as well they're just wipes um so like when i go to the grocery store and stuff i was thinking like i don't have anything like that i need to maybe invest in that so I bought some wipes that I can wipe down the buggy before I put my hands on it or give the people behind me a courtesy because I do have two children that um are dirty <laughs> and uh so clean it off before I give it to the next person uh, out of courtesy but and this is the wallet that I'm 
carrying. I love this pattern. Love it. Um, however, so I'm contemplating of whether or not um, I should keep keep it. I love the accordion wallets. They seem to work for so many people. Um, they open up so big. They have like this one has dividers. Like it's really awesome. But I just I don't know. I really like my turn lock wallet because it's got the two ID case, like two ID placeholders and military and driver's license. It's just perfect. I can easily access both of those. So I might, I don't know. So that's why I was like, I need to wear this one or carry this one to really just, in order for me to keep it, I need to use it in order to justify keeping it, if that makes sense. So um, I'm using it right now. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it or not. So it's on the chopping block as much as I love this wallet. Like it is so happy and it has my my girl my girl right here Tinkerbell and you know just the fireworks it's just I love it but the functionality just doesn't always work out for me and I don't know it did come with like a wristlet thing and it's somewhere maybe I'll find it today while I'm cleaning out my closet but um yeah, so that's only two things that have changed with this one. However, um, we are going to visit family in, <coughs> excuse me, Ooh. one second. Sorry about that. I like, got a cot in my throat. Um, so, of course, I washed it down with coffee, not water. Um, but we are going to see family in a few weeks. And we're planning a few trips like out and about where we're going to be walking a pretty good bit outside. And um, I might break into the safe <laughs> and um, get that out, the backpack, because that might just um, work out better for that trip. Maybe. I'm still torn because I don't want to break the challenge. But then I'm like, but that one may make more sense for that experience. Um but still take this with me and um yeah and then when at the end of april we are supposed to be going to the keys on a camping trip which will be a lot of fun um and but there will be like canoeing and things like that so i think if anything um i probably will take the backpack for that one just because it's hands-free it's on my back, not on my side. Like where if I sit down in the canoe, it'll be on my back, not, you know. Um, so those are my two places where I think I might break the rules, but I think that's okay. Let me know, if, let me know if you think that's okay. Um, and oh, so I had to go to the dentist the other day. So um, I got a permanent crown so i had a crown put on in college and it was starting to like go bad um so they put a new one on and they did the, i got the permanent one and i was flossing my teeth and it popped off so yesterday morning i had to go back in and get it like re put on um but i hate the dentist like they're so nice but i hate the dentist so um i held my purse like like this literally like a stuffed animal but it was just so comforting I don't know it's just the size of the car sin and how squishy it is but like I just held on to it and it felt like a stuffed animal and it was so nice so uh another perk of a cotton bag is just how nice it felt at the dentist it was so comforting um but yeah there's my story time but everything went good it's back on hopefully it stays on this time um it does come with a warranty. I'm probably giving too much information, but I was pretty, I was worried that they were going to like charge me for it. I'm like, I just got it less than two weeks ago. Like this is on you, not me. Um, but I hate confrontation. So I just went in, it's like texting my husband. They didn't ask me for money. So I guess we're in the clear. And then afterwards, she's like, if it falls off again or, you know, whatever, it does have a five year warranty on it. So, so that was good news. Good news. 
Um, oh, there was something else I was going to tell y'all. Oh, I can't remember. Oh, I think I might do a video, like a separate video of like Vera Bradley items that I use often that I kind of forgot were Vera Bradley just because they're so much part of my routine. Um, I mean, there's not like a lot, but just, you know, like the pen that I use on a daily basis, which is downstairs with my journaling, but it's Vera Bradley and, you know, my makeup bag, my ditty bag, um, my eyeglass case, all those things, um, that I use. And I'm like, oh, huh, I do, I do use quite a lot more Vera Bradley than just my purse. Um. But anyways, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and if you're watching this on a Thursday when I'm recording it, I hope you have a thriving Thursday, and um, hopefully I'll talk to you soon. And yeah, let me know if you think I'm breaking the challenge or not, or if it's okay. I know I am, but let me know if you think it's okay if I'm breaking the challenge for those situations. But alright, be blessed.